I'm Nikita for The Developer Show. This is your weekly update on the coolest developer news from Google. Launched over six years ago, the Google Cloud Speech API processes more than 1 billion voice minutes each month. And the team is excited to announce the GA release of the newest Speech-to-Text V2 API. This release includes accuracy improvements, a new pricing tier, and features like recognizers, cloud logging, and audio format auto detection. Check out the blog below for documentation and walkthroughs. Go 1.21 has been released and it's packed with new features and improvements like language changes, including new built-in functions, standard library additions, improved performance, tool improvements, and an experimental port for WebAssembly system interface. For a full list, refer to the release notes below. As part of the Compose August 23 Bill of Material, version 1.5 of Jetpack Compose has been released, Android's modern native UI toolkit. This release largely focuses on improvements in performance and memory usage and new features in the core APIs. To learn more, check out the blog below. On the Chrome side, for the 116 release, we have the Document Picture in Picture API, Not Restored Reasons Property to Optimize BF Cache Use, Easier Missing Style Sheet Debugging in DevTools, and plenty more. For the full details, check out the video linked in the description. Finally, Project IDX is a new browser-based development experience built on Google Cloud and powered by Kodi, a foundational AI model trained on code and built on Palm 2. It's designed to make it easier to build, manage, and deploy full-stack web and multi-platform applications with popular frameworks and languages. Check out the link below to learn more and to sign up and be one of the first to try Project IDX. To learn more about all of this week's stories, make sure to check the description box below for all of the links. Please remember to like, subscribe, share, and stay safe. I'm Nikita for The Developer Show. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next week. Okay, this is very big. I'm like, what can I do with this plant that doesn't look absurd? <laughs>